Hey guys, welcome back to my Agrarian Skies 2 behind the scenes. And this time I would like to show you how we're going to automate having a processor built. So what I want to do is be able to build one of those just by clicking craft. So, we'll go back down to the basement and we're going to make it here. This this is temporary. We're going to fix all this up. Um, and have other rooms available but for right now this is my plan so I'm going to kind of sw walk you through kind of what I did so first um, one of the issues I have is because underneath there is a void um, I need to get this up a little bit higher so for right now this has to go up here so there's the inscriber so to make the processor we need to have silicone, one of these go into here, we need to have redstone go into there, and then we need to have the chip go up on top. So right away I know that I need to have the interface go up here. And that's not the interface, not at all. That, that, that was wrong. Wrong. Interface right there. Boom. And in the interface we need to have a pattern one for each of the processors. So I want to, here's a calculation processor, here's the engineering processor. Let's go see, I'll show you how to make these processor things, or those patterns. Um, let me just make sure I have that in there. So I do have one of those, so let me take one of those, I'm going to take both of those, and we'll take that. And if you ever mess up on your patterns, all you need to do is put that in there. It makes a blank pattern. So I need to make oops, a processing pattern, right? I need to make a processor out of a logic circuit board. So we make this processing, not crafting, and I put the logic circuit board there and that there. Make it, and boom, we have that all done. Okay, so then I can come and put that down there. So we, that's what you do for all three. Um, so all it's doing is it's going to make a call. I need to get the, the engineering, um, the printed engineering circuit, and then we'll make the processor. So that's going to be up there. But what I need on the bottom is I need to have an export bus. Export bus will take something from the inventory and it will put it into this item. I'm going to put one back here too um, because we need to get down here I need a printed I need a printed silicon and up here I need redstone. Okay. In addition to that if these aren't made I want to give this the option to actually make it. So use stocked items or craft items while exporting. Okay, so I made a crafting card and, and you could see how to make those crafting cards right here. Pretty easy, just the crafting table and then there. Okay, so we have this kind of set up. I need to power it up. And this is not the most efficient, but this is how I'm doing it. So it's going into there. It's going straight up to there. And notice silicon and the redstones in there. We have that. And then remember before when we had these ones, I needed a way they had to be ex they put inputted back into the system. We do the same thing for this. I'm going to actually do it on the front. So I need this import bus. I'm going to do it right there. And I am going to take this and run it right up there. Okay, so let's go see if this works. And it's getting dark. Let's see if we can do this before it gets dark. I want to make one of those. So next one one start and it should take five six seconds 
And if I did everything right, boom, it made one. Let's see if I can do one of those. Next, there, start. And again, five to six seconds. And we got one of those, and the last one. Oh, what happened? And start. I, I think it hadn't finished running its, um, from the previous one. And we got all those. So, there you go. Quick and dirty. Um, we were able to set up a crafting system so that we can um, get the processors and that'll help us start um, making everything um, that we need for this system. Right now I'm just working on making it so all the components of this system can be made. If you notice I have all these different patterns. It's kind of cool. I'm kind of obsessed. Um, so you know if you want to make something complicated. What is complicated in here? Um, is that complicated? Let's see what we need. Yeah, it's not that complicated. What is complicated? Import bus. Yeah, kinda. Let's see, so it's taking all of this stuff. It has to craft one of those that and we can start and see it's made one of those it's doing stuff over there and we do have the import bus it is pretty quick okay there you go quick and dirty um, now we have that's how I did the processing of um, processors <laughs> um, check out my main um, agrarian skies too um, see me put it all together and um, see how I'm, I'm getting along. I think I want to automate this next, see if I can do something with that. It has to be a way. Right now I'm just dropping stuff in and I'm actually, I don't know what I'm doing here. I am, what am I doing? Oh, here it is. Oh yeah, I'm pulling out the charged things in there. So really I think this is automated, I just need to put an export bus on top. Yeah, that'll be easy. Um, so maybe I won't show that. Anyway, thank you for watching. Goodbye.